I'm Jada Williams in Tampa. Millions of dollars is now coming into our local communities and it's all to increase community policing efforts. Tampa's police department will soon welcome another 30 officers. It's thanks to a $3.75 million grant from the U.S. Department of Justice. And the bottom line is that these dollars and the officers that we hire are going to make a real difference in the cities or the, in the neighborhoods across our city. The announcement comes just days after two were killed and 16 others injured in a shooting in Ybor City. It takes the community and our police department working together to change this dynamic that leads to this type of violence. I reached out to the mayor's office for comment, but they declined to speak. They told me that TPD would be best to talk about the subject. TPD also declined, pointing me to a statement they released earlier. As recipients of these grants, we can more effectively address gun violence while expanding on our mission of working in partnership with the diverse community we serve to reduce crime and make Tampa safer together. In a release, Tampa PD says the money will help launch programs that analyze and assess problems, add more resources to community policing efforts, and increase engagement in community partnerships. They're also getting another $160,000 for de-escalation trainings. And they're not the only local law enforcement agency to get this money. Citrus County Sheriff's Office received $5,375,000. For us to get 43 of those 44 positions approved through this COPS grant is absolutely amazing. We're stunned beyond all description. There's about 162,000 people in Citrus County. The county's population has grown about 65% in the last three decades but not much growth behind the badge. We knew that the only way we could really do more for our citizens right here and now for the population that we have, since we were so grossly understaffed and not being able to meet the needs for the call volume, is take advantage of this uh, community-ordered policing grant through the Department of Justice. All to move the needle on not only safety in the community, but public trust as well. In Tampa, Jada Williams, ABC Action News.